So, hey guys, what's going on? My name is Jacob from Cinema Care Productions, and welcome to the comprehensive review of the Antline Mod Mic 5. So, for those of you guys that have been with the channel for a bit, you'll know that I have the Antline Mod Mic 4 as well, and I did a review about a year ago on it. You can go back on my channel, actually, there'll be a link somewhere right over here for it right now. We recently purchased the Antline Mod Mic 5 here at Cinema Care Productions, and I just wanted to do a little bit of a review of it and see what you guys think. Right now, personally, I actually do think that it is better than my AT2020 that I have right next to me. This studio grade microphone that costed me about 120 bucks two years ago with, you know, all this other stuff that comes with it, you know, the the scissor arm, the shock mount, the pop filter, the other pop filter, everything that comes with it. I mean, I spent like 200 bucks just on that. And then with this, 70. And you guys are currently hearing everything that it sounds like. So everything that comes inside the box, you obviously get your mod mic, the um, Antlion mod mic 5. And then you get the mute switch, you get two cables, one of them is one meter, one of them is two meters. I currently am using the two meter because I have to link it up to my mixer. And they're both 3.5 millimeter headphone jacks, so make sure that you always have one of those. You should have one available. It comes with a little case too, that's pretty cool, it's right here. Uh, it's just a little durability case, I don't really know what the point of it is. It came with a bag of goodies like cable clips more 3M tape, an extra pop filter just in case you lose this one. It actually comes with this really, really thick cable wrap. It's really awesome the way it works. It it took me about five minutes to do it all, honestly, and that's like the most negative review that this thing gets. It's just that this thing takes forever. I didn't even know what I was doing. It only took me like five minutes, so you are all really dumb. And of course, it comes with an instructions manual. Nobody ever reads it. So a thing that's really, really cool about the Antlion Mod Mic 5 is it has Uni and Omnidirectional all in one. Usually if you bought the Antlion Mod Mic 4, you'd have to buy one with Omnidirectional or Unidirectional. If you don't know what the difference is, Unidirectional is one direction, meaning it's pointed right towards my mouth right now and that's all that it's going to capture. Omnidirectional means it'll open up the microphone to a whole landscape, meaning it can capture everything in this room and it'll capture all with the same audio. So it's all one big wrap. I'm currently using the Unidirectional uh, just because I'm doing a little voiceover, but the little switch is right there. I don't know if you guys could see it. Oh wait, no, it's on my side, isn't it? Oh. All right, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but it's right there. You can kind of see it. There's a little switch. I'm not going to do anything with it because there's really no point. I'm not going to change it to omnidirectional for this tutorial because I don't want to mess up my audio settings. I think this thing sounds literally perfect right now. Now, something that's weird to take note of, I usually uh, will record with voice meter, which is like a, just a mixer on your computer that you can download, and whenever I just threw this microphone in there, it has a lot of white noise. This right here is the microphone that I'm using. So if I just stop talking really quick, you can see all this white noise. It should cap out right here. But what's really weird is that you guys don't hear the white noise. I'll hear the white noise if I go in and like edit all the settings and everything, and I want to listen to my device, I'll hear it, but whenever I actually go back into my recordings from OBS, you guys don't hear anything. So it's actually perfect. Another thing that I should mention is that I actually have this thing hooked up to my mixer, like I said earlier. So uh, you guys might get a little bit of a different outcome with your results, but uh, I currently have the Zenny X302 USB, link will be in the description for it. It's really, really cheap mixer board if you guys want to get into them. All you have to do is just hook it up to it, the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and then you just adjust your audio levels, gain, and bass, treble, and balance. I didn't adjust the balance or anything, but um, the bass, treble, I definitely adjusted. I've never been more satisfied with a headset microphone in my entire life. The fact that you can just take this headset and disconnect the microphone just like that. So for those of you guys that don't know what Antlion is, Antlion is basically a company that makes microphones that you can detach from your headset that doesn't originally have a microphone on it. Uh, for instance, if I ever wanted to take this headset, which doesn't have a microphone on it, I could attach this little button to it and then just attach my microphone just like that. It's that easy. And then you're just ready to go. I'm definitely going to be making a few recordings with this thing in the future. Uh, I just want to see how it holds up with gameplay. If it picks up my headset noise, that would be interesting. In fact, we're going to go and blare some Spotify real quick. I am currently blaring this music as loud as it can right now. I can't even hear myself talk. And if you guys can hear anything, let me know down in the comments below because I personally think this thing's gonna hold its worth. For those of you out there that are looking for a new headset or a new microphone, I definitely recommend this device to you. It's amazing. That's all there is to it. I mean, literally listen to my voice right now. What kind of headset microphone that you know that isn't above $200 
that just gets this quality out of the box like this it's perfect but yeah that's basically the unboxing the review of everything I have to say so far I literally just got this today so I'll probably have another review coming out in like a week just showing general things that I think they could change with it but so far I think it's pretty perfect the only thing that I think they could do to improve this object is make a Bluetooth I currently hate wires I mean wires are so annoying everybody hates wires um, if you can go Bluetooth, I definitely, definitely would, Antlion. I would spend 120 bucks on a microphone like this if it was Bluetooth. Same quality, same everything. I know that's really, really hard to do, but I have faith in you guys. You guys actually do listen. That's another thing that's great about Antlion. They actually listen to their customers. They have changed so much, and it's only from their fan base. They literally listen to everything that we want, everything we don't want, and they change it how we expect it to be. If you guys do want to pick up an Antlion mod mic for yourself, links will be down in the description for you guys. If you guys want to pick up anyone, you can check them all out. Anywho, my name is Jacob from Cinema Camp Productions. Thank you guys so much for stopping by, and I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.